Hey everybody, welcome back to Satisfactory. We are working on getting our steel foundries together at least, not steel production. Steel foundries though, they're coming together. And in between episodes, um, I went and I got our miner set up. I got some of the belts run. I also went back and fixed up some of our coal uh, production issues. We weren't really having issues yet, but there were some belts that need to be upgraded, and I did need to put power slugs in our coal miners because they are only on normal modes, so they're only producing 60, and I need them to be producing 120, so they are now doing that. The belts are all 120, so that is all good to go, and I've also connected the second layer of our coal generating station there, so now all 12 of those coal generators are running. So we have lots of power to play with, which I'll go check in a second. Uh, we are still drinking our Moscow Mule, which is vodka, ginger beer, and lime juice. Cheers. Yeah. Now, speaking of coal, we do have to bring coal over here and that that's gonna be a bit of an issue. So let's see where our power is here. Yeah, so we're producing 1,200 power. And 7.5 for some reason. I'm not sure where that 7.5 came from. Uh, I do have one, one coal generator on each level with one level of power slug in it, so maybe that's why I'm having like a decimal number. Yeah, that probably. That makes sense. Anyhow, yeah, I do need to get coal over here. And I realize we only have one coal node which is close, which is going to only give us 120 for a little while until we get our belts and miner upgraded, unfortunately. Because I think we need um, 360 here to have all six of these running, right? 90. No, 270. Oh, it's only 270? Okay, perfect. So as soon as we get our Mark III belts and our next tier miners up, then that should be good. But we will not be producing enough co coal, excuse me, to begin with for the number of uh, foundries I've built here. Now, first thing I want to do is let's get these set up and ready to go. So when coal does come, we will immediately be making steel. That is going to look like this. Um, I'm going to get all the, let's put a door in here for now. I'm going to put, what am I going to say here? I'm going to put all the, uh, splitters and mergers and all that stuff, get those all hooked up and ready to go. Well, it's, it's really just splitters. <laughs> okay, conveyor splitter. And we're going to do our usual stack. Which again, is going to be way awesome once we get our blueprints in. Because I'll be able to set these... Oops. I'll be able to set the uh, foundries up with this stuff already hooked up. I want to go through and manly build these and then erase the middle one and then run all my belts. Like that will all be ready to go. So that will be pretty sweet. So I'm gonna get these first three set up and running. And I'm gonna go, I'm going to go and get our coal set up and running, get our truck line going, and then we'll start making our first batch of steel products in those constructors. Cause I, I really wanna get steel up cause I'm gonna need Mark three belts go on sooner rather than later. And that will help with that. Okay, so that is all good. Let's get some of these belts. Nice. So I got iron already here. And I believe we're actually lacking still in iron as well. Um, oh no, I have just the right amount. Wait, do I go around? 45, 90. 
Yes, so it's 105, right? 115. 45, 9. No, it's 135. Shoot. So I don't have I don't have quite enough. But I don't have quite enough coal yet either, so it doesn't really matter. But basically I have four iron mines going for one bank, and then these other four iron mines will be for the secondary bank of uh, foundries. So let's oh let's not fall off. That's not a good idea. Why don't we get these up here? We're not ready for these yet, but let's just do it now. We're here. Okay. And these are going to need a merger. Now, I know I say things are going to be temporary a lot. This is probably kind of how this is going to look. At least for a long, long time, because, I don't know, I guess I could put, like, a tower kind of set up or something to make this look a little a little bit neater, but, I don't know, man. Oh, these only need to be tier 4 at this point. Yeah, so after these merge, these need to be tier 4. Okay, or Mark 2, sorry. Also, it would probably help if these things actually had power. Now I ran I ran a pole down there. Where's Where's the pole? Is that not it? No, maybe. No, maybe I didn't. I could have sworn I ran a pole down for these. Yeah, that is easily rectified. Okay. Very good, very good. Let's get one of these right here and get this going into there. So at least when the time comes, the, the iron is at least here. The final thing we're going to do is get some mergers, not splitters. And yes, I made this building probably a little bit bigger than I needed to, but... We got lots of space to work with. Oh my god. Backwards again. We got lots of space to work with, so I don't need to be super concerned about trying to conserve space over here. We're going to worry about that in our main factory. Down here is all nice and luxurious. We can squander space as we need. Okay, and let's put a splitter here. Just so these are making steel products for us once we get coal. Uh, hello? So I think I have two steel beams. Yeah, two steel beams and one set of tubes. Or steel pipes. What do you call steel pipes? Steel pipes. Alright. So that is that. The only other thing we need is this hooked up. And you're going to unload, yeah. Sweet. So... Let's just go by foot. I hate to do it, but... That's probably the easiest way to do it. Or quickest way to do it. I saw you over there, where'd you go? Can't catch me, I'm too fast. Aha. What say you do that? That's what I thought. Alright. So that's our coal down there. So let's go this way. Our truck station is going to be here. On the other side of this rock pile that screws me up all the time. Hello, this is Paternal Figure. Okay, you need to get bopped. I'm gonna bop your. Jesus. I'm gonna bop your other friend as well while I'm here. Who is. Who is a rock? That's a rock. That is not a hog. Okay. Important distinction. 
walkway. Very nice. Oh, there's... There's two coal nodes here, isn't there? Nope. Nope, there's one. Okay, never mind. Shoot, okay. So there is another coal mode further off in that direction. I probably am going to need to get it at some point. Did I have a miner? I did build a miner. And this is pure, right? Yeah, it is perfect. At some point, in order to support our steel industry, I am going to need to tap into that node. But I'm not too concerned. Yet. This will be able to support us for a while, especially once we start putting power slugs in it and get like tier 2 miners and stuff. This will be giving us enough coal to keep us happy for a little while. So, that is good. Now before I run away, let's actually hook it up. I did. Is there coal coming? There is. Yes, perfect. Take this belt up to the truck station, which does not exist yet. Ooh, I saw a pill bear back there. Hello, pillberry. Sure. Okay, build me a truck station. Comply. I will, I will. Picking up multiple fixes of fortunately. Proceed with harvest. I do not want you here. You provided a great service. Consider yourself honorably retired. Alright. This. Whoa, that was crazy. Is that because of the rock? Harvest. Nope. Yeah, that belt's a little freaky, but whatever. Oh, I hear you. That work? Yes. All right. Cool. And you are set to load. You are. Let's build Your another tractor. Tells you to harvest this artifact. So you can see this is going to be a very tractor-heavy game, as opposed to the cliffside base, where I think there was this one. I think we only had one tractor running. Start facing the right direction here. Harvest. I will, I will. Actually, no, no, I won't. Because hopefully I don't come back here for a long, long time. So start recording. You know what? Let's not do our pauses. Let's, we'll stop there. We'll stop there long enough for it to recognize and put down that pause icon. This and we'll see if it stops long enough to actually do what we need it to do. Say that the only remedy is alien artifacts. God, these freaking artifacts. Man. So noisy. Okay. Take me up here. I still want to try to not... Oh, crap. My truck's here. I want to not, like, block traffic if I can help it. So, I don't think I'll have more than one truck. Oh, no. Here, I'll have more than one truck. But at that original station, I should only have one truck going back and forth. So I want to make sure I don't block traffic at that station. Now, eventually, it will probably end up being trains loading and unloading there. But that's, again, not going to be for a little bit. Okay, cool. Feel free to do your thing. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Alright, cool. Now, if you could 
Oh, it went there first. I see. Okay. All right, buddy. Good luck. Oh, I want to turn off your path notes too. Uh, do not show path notes. I gotta do that for the other truck still. So this is how fast Blade Runners are. We're gonna beat this truck back. Granted, it's it's got a slightly more roundabout way to go than I do, but yeah, man, perfect. Yeah, just don't let me forget I parked that truck under the <laughs> under this. So if I'm looking for it later, that's where it is. I'm pretty sure I put a ladder here. Yes, I did. All right, now. Yeah, that was pretty interesting. I don't know why I did that. Um, let's get coal in here. And coal is going to mirror this. Okay. Which means we're going to have to... Two belts. That's roughly in line. Nope. That is not the right direction. Ay, ay, ay. All right. How does this look? So you are going to come over here. What is the sound that sounds like spiders running around that I hear all over this area? That is super weird. I don't like it because it makes me think there's spiders around. And I don't know if you saw episode 3, but spiders and me do not get along. <laughs> Alright, so that should be good. You're still backwards, because I didn't set that up. That's too bad. I should have done that while I was up there, too. Oh, well. I'll go do it right now, real quick. But that should be our coal and our steel going. Yeah, there goes the coal. Perfect. That is fantastic. Let's keep doing this, because I'm pretty sure this is good to go now, right? Yes, it is. Yes, it is. Awesome. And then all those machines will start up. And then we can hook these up and just absolutely crush our coal supply. <laughs> Actually, I am not going to plumb in the coal here yet. I will get everything else, and by everything else I mean the iron, the only other thing. I'll get the iron put in, and then stop. Are these not in line? Oh no, they're in line. Okay.
All right, I only have three. Right, 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 right. Okay, maybe what I'll do is I will plumb everything in except for the... Or, yeah, I'll plumb the coal in, I won't plumb the iron in. Just to keep these from going. Or from starting up. Okay. I don't want these running yet because I want my constructors to be getting fed from the other side, and I want all the coal going to that side for now, because I'm going to need it all there. Actually, I'm going to need more than I have available there, which obviously is not going to work, but... Yeah, like, you're probably lacking coal, right? Yeah. Oh, well, that's why we need to get this steel going. Oh, you're lacking coal because you didn't connect the belt. Well, that means you also don't have a belt connected. Okay. Minor detail. Oops. This is not in line with this. This should be here. Okay. The other thing we need, which I just realized, is fuel for our truck. Okay, at the, at the factory, I'm the main factory, I'm going to hook up fuel from our other uh, coal line there to the other truck station, for the delivery truck station for the steel ingots. And that's how that will, that coal will be supplied, is like that. Now, you go away. You come here. Like so. Okay, good. So that's good to go. As soon as we hook up the steel, or the iron, I should say, this line will be running. But I don't want to do that yet. What we can do while we're waiting is hook up this steel unloading line. Now, unfortunately... Didn't build a truck station up there yet. Shoot. I was hoping I'd be able to do this all in one go. Like, run this up there. Do the, rec the uh, recording, I should say. But I'm not going to be able to do that. I won't be able to record this path yet. So I'll have to go up, plumb in that truck station. I can also plumb in the coal for it for the fuel while I'm up there. Then I can record this path. Which means I'm going to start from up there and end up there, unfortunately. Which means I'm going to be running back to our steel area. Oh well. Not the most efficient. But sometimes that happens. And yeah, then we're going to be making steel. Well, we are making steel. We're making steel products. Temporarily, but we're making them. And we'll be able to get to our next milestone pretty soon. Which is... Well... Wow. Oh, what am I doing? I'm panicking. I want to go this way. Yeah, I didn't build the other truck station. Okay, that's fine. We can do that. Oh yeah, so these road barriers. <laughs> Not the best. I might have to rework this. I'll see if my trucks have issues getting, like, running over or getting stuck or anything. I mean, it's really more visual than anything. One thing I, I was considering is something like this. Oh, I didn't unlock it yet. Shoot. 
um, using the, the concrete beams. So you put the concrete beam underneath, and then you put the uh, these gates on top, the barriers on top. But I haven't unlocked the uh, concrete beams yet. So that is not going to work. Yet. You won't build here because the truck's in the way? Are you serious? That's annoying. Alright, we'll go over here. I mean, all these barriers won't do anything. <laughs> awesome. And you can go right there. Yeah. Good, good. Coal truck is still... Still making it. All it would take is for that coal truck to get hung up on something, and then that's like... We're just, we're just screwed completely. Oh, you do a weird unload too. Interesting. What are you doing in terms of coal? You are very full. Okay. Interesting. So... I would like this built differently. I would like this built here, I think. More like this. Yeah. Yeah, like that, I think. So this one is actually bumped out a bit into the truck area, so let's let's keep it the same. Yeah. And this is gonna be the same thing. Oh, that's awful. This is not lining up nicely at all. Oh well. That's fine. We would like coal to come in here. So, how would you like to do this splitter thing? Did you snap? Is this gonna work? Man, this this is so good. This splitter thing, snapping the splitters to the the lifts. Oh man. I feel like that's something they need to. Oh. Oh, never mind. It's not working. This must have snapped to the actual lift itself. Okay. That's fine. Although how come it didn't work that time? Oh, I wonder if it's got to be... I bet you it's got a face. So, like, the input needs to come from the, the direction that the lift is actually facing. Now, it could also be that it's not snapping properly because of how tight everything is. Let's just try. Let's see what happens. No, okay. Okay. Well, I'm not too worried about it down here, because there is lots of space. You're not going to work, are you? Yeah, it's too tight. Shoot. Hmm. Okay, let's do this then. If I put a... You're my splitter. Oh, you're already splitting. Oh, well, in that case. You've already got a splitter. Let's just keep using it. Right? That makes sense to me. Uh, give me you. Make this look a little neater, though. 
for sure. And you... And then not be in the right spot. <laughs> How am I doing for time? Oh, I'm running out of time. Okay, I think in between episodes... Oh my god. I think I'm going to put a cut in here. I am going to record the path for the truck. I'm so bad at this. Oh my god. Oh, okay, never mind. That worked. I'm going to record the path for the truck in between episodes. And then we will start the next episode back in at our steel uh, foundry area. Yeah, so I'm going to put a cut in here. Thank you so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed the episode. If you did, please give us a like and subscribe. It helps us out a lot. And we will see you next time. Cheers.